The Philippines and China have accused each other of running vessels and performing dangerous and unlawful maneuvers in the disputed South China Sea. It is the latest flare-up after the two nations agreed last month to try and manage disagreements at sea. The incident occurred near Sabina Shoal in the early hours of Monday morning. China's Coast Guard said a Philippine vessel had ignored repeated warnings and had deliberately collided with its boat in an unprofessional and dangerous manner. The Philippines disputed Beijing's account, accusing it of imposing its version of facts. It said two Coast Guard vessels had encountered unlawful and aggressive maneuvers from Chinese vessels, resulting in structural damage to both vessels. The Chinese Coast Guard released this video of the incident, showing what it said was a Philippine Coast Guard ship deliberately ramming one of their vessels. The Philippines said the video is misleading. Here's the Philippines South China Sea Task Force spokesperson Jonathan Malaya. Despite these incidents, both Philippine Coast Guard vessels remain committed to and shall proceed with their mission of delivering essential supplies to personnel stationed on Patag and Lawak Islands. The Philippine Coast Guard stands firm in its responsibility to ensure the safety and security of our maritime domain while addressing any and all threats to our national interest. Chinese Foreign Ministry spokesperson Mao Ning said China would continue to take lawful, resolute and forceful measures to safeguard its territorial sovereignty, maritime rights and interests. The US has condemned the incident and said it stands by the Philippines. Sabina Shell is in the Spratly Islands, which are claimed by China, the Philippines, Taiwan and Vietnam.